Welcome, so in this tutorial, I'm going to show you or teach you on how to convert Binance Peg Ethereum to ERC20. So to do this, you can use the Binance Bridge. So the Binance Bridge is a tool provided by Binance that allows you to transfer assets between different blockchains. Okay, so we, here's the guide on how to convert it. So first of all, you need to access Binance Bridge. So visit the Binance Bridge website. So just go ahead and search for binance.org forward slash bridge, okay? Or search for Binance Bridge in your preferred search engine. Now connect your wallet. So on the Binance Bridge website, click on the connect wallet button and select the wallet that holds your best token. Just ensure that your wallet is compatible with Binance Bridge that supports connecting to external websites. Now select the token and amount. After connecting your wallet, select BETH as the token you want to convert. Enter the amount of BETH you want to convert to ERC20 ETH. So take note of any minimum or maximum limits imposed by Binance Bridge. Now choose the target network. Select the ERC20 ETH. Ethereum network as a target network for the conversion. This is the network compatible with most Ethereum wallets and services. Now, initiate the conversion. So after specifying the token, amount, and target network, click on the convert or bridge button to initiate the conversion process. Now confirm the transaction. So your wallet pro will prompt you to confirm the transaction, review the transaction details, including gas fees and any other relevant information. Follow the prompts and provided by your wallet to proceed with the confirmation. Now wait for the conversion to complete. So once the transaction is confirmed, you will need to wait for the conversion to be processed on the Binance bridge. The time will the time it takes may vary depending on network congestions and other factors. Now verify your ERC20 ETH balance. So after the conversion is completed, you should see the ERC20 ETH balance in your wallet. Check your wallet balance or transaction history to confirm the arrival of the ERC20 ETH token. So it is important to note that the process may incur gas fees and other network costs and the availability of Binance Bridge and supported networks may change over time. Therefore, it is recommended to refer to the official Binance Bridge website for the most up-to-date instructions in and information. And that's it. I hope this video helped you and if it did, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell notification so you won't miss a video. See you in the next one and have a great day!